Special Rural Assistance Committee. She was uh, uh, very active in that. She speaks some Bangla. I'm not going to say that she's uh, perfectly fluent, but she, uh, uh, anyway, she uh, certainly has a heart for the people. She uh, knows the community, uh, and she keeps uh, keeps the people of Bangladesh near and dear to the congressman's heart. And so please know that that family is very focused on these issues. Um, I guess quickly I'd say that uh, our office benefits from relationships with a number of you in this room, and, and some folks who couldn't be here tonight, I wanted to say a particular thanks to the people who are always in our office reminding us of the importance of uh, of uh, this of our uh, of our foreign relationships, uh, Zia Islam is always in our office. He's always inviting us to the uh, Bangladesh uh, Day Parade, and so uh, thank you for all of your work. And you're a good friend. Uh, I would like to say Mzum Chowdhury is uh, a good friend. I know he uh, he and the congressman spoke uh, even I think this last month over uh, on some issues. Uh, Jaleel Khan, I know uh, I know you've been very active with the non-resident Bangladeshis. I know that uh, you brought some uh, some paperwork you're going to pass along to the ambassador tonight. So thank you for your continued, uh, continued uh, outreach and uh, appreciate your, your presence here tonight when you're uh, working through these issues. Uh, and lastly, Mr. Chowdhury, who, uh, who is uh, a good friend of the office. Uh, he has uh, worked with uh, Fobana, uh, and uh, um, you know, who I think uh, Congressman Sherman was very grateful to be honored uh, as I think the uh, uh, Congressman of the Year uh, for Fobana this year, which was nice. He was, uh, he was very complimented by that. Uh, he's also a member of the Bangladesh Caucus. Uh, 